Well, shooters and reloaders out there, it's Fortune Cookie 45LC coming to you from the hot lead zone. And what we have here are cast bullets, the Lee 405 grain 457 hollow base round nose bullet for the 4570 458 Win Mag. And we cast these out of 16 1 alloy, and then we went ahead and powder coated them with Eastwood powder, a mix of Eastwood powders. And now we're going to go ahead and run them through our sizer because these measure at 4 6 1 inch. And so we want to size them back down to 4 5 8 inches. And a real good way to do it will be with the RCBS Lubomatic 2 sizer lubricator. Now notice these grease grooves in these bullets are wide and that's because this is a black powder design and black powder designs all have big generous grease grooves and a lot of them to hold lots of lube. And here's what they look like when they're lubed. You'll notice running them through the sizer lubricator makes the bullets much more uniform base wise they're all much flatter on that glass than the pre-sized bullets. And notice all the grease grooves are filled with lots of lube. Perfect for black powder, but also good for smokeless. Let's show you the RCBS Lubomatic 2 in action. As you know, the reloading and the casting, the bullet casting videos, are really under a lot of pressure on YouTube. So they're all on the Patreon Three Circles site under Fortune Cookie 45 LC, and there are about 44 open house visitors videos that are exclusive to the Three Circles that anyone can take in by visiting the site. So you're welcome over there just to check things out. So here we take a raw bullet and set it into the platform. And then we pull the handle down on our RCBS Lubematic 2 to drive the bullet into the die. And then we pressurize, we pressurize the lube in the lube reservoir by turning the little pressurizing screw on top here and that causes the pressure to increase in the lube reservoir driving the lube through the die and into the grease grooves. As you see here notice how nicely filled all those grooves are and no lube got into the hollow base. Show you one more of those. So again, take a bullet, set it on the platform, get it square. That one's got a little funny thing on the base, so we'll get it square. And then into the die it goes, pressurize the lube reservoir, and eject the bullet. And look at that perfectly filled, easy, clean, and very reliably done. Well, it doesn't take long before you have a whole passel of them. So all of you casters and powder coaters out there, good lubricizing to you. Indeed, look at those rascals. Well, you might ask, why did you go ahead and put lube in these? After all, you powder coated these bullets, so there's no real need to lube them also. Well, it turns out that I'm going to shoot these for fun. And the idea of having some smoke so it looks like black powderish shooting, why not? If these bullets could talk, they'd say, you shoot them right and I'll get you a buffalo. Bye for now.